Hi everybody, welcome back to Time Predicts and uh, here's another reading. I'm taking a few personal readings right now and to the people who haven't replied to, please keep patience because I will uh, reply to the emails next week as my daughter has not been too well. So I wrote some of the messages that what they're wanting to tell you, what are they dying to tell you. This message came twice. I took out the cards uh, where I'd written messages before and I had a similar message. So this really makes sense and that's what I thought. I've never left you as a part of a way very very important message i feel uh, you felt or uh, they felt that mind games were involved and uh, you were so confused about are they there are they not there have if they haven't called or if they haven't connected maybe they do not want to be there so you were also getting uh, worried that are these mind games or not but yet, yes yes uh, they have not left you that's what they're saying and these are not mind games okay they might come across as mind games because maybe they're not very clear in how they put things across not very uh, not a very good conversationalist probably uh, not very a uh, good with not very good with words so maybe that's why you were left wondering i see the rest of my life without uh, sorry why does i say without you <laughs> with you so definitely means uh, i see the rest of my life with the, uh, with you and i think without you you could be thinking that's why it's coming out of my mouth right now but uh, really uh, they want to be with you okay and if you thought that yes they could uh, be without you that is not possible or they'll go without you not possible definitely emotional about you is totally totally belongs there i'll tell you why because i've got emotional about you that can you i wrote can you in fact i was writing i think can you sense that i'm getting uh, that i'm emotional about you or can you feel it that i do you know have emotions for you i don't know if i use the word emotions i'll just check the cards i don't remember but yes emotional about you definitely definitely makes sense bad timing of course the timing wasn't right that's that's what they want to tell that uh, the timing wasn't right guys okay and uh, that's why probably uh, you thought that they are not going to you know come back or call or whatever but the timing wasn't right is the only thing that i get and that's what they want to uh, say and look at this card you know uh, two are here there's happiness so let's put it here there is happiness you know along the way or in the time to come and that's going to happen pretty soon and it is also i've been through hell so bad timing and i've been through hell um, you know go pretty much together hand in hand probably the timing wasn't right of uh, the relationship or whatever happened the timing wasn't right uh, maybe health was an issue money career anything family friends anything uh, you know caused a problem but it wasn't that they did not want to be with you. I think the timing wasn't right. And they've been through hell. I think they've been battling something, some kind of a problem. Could be a, you know, could be a past relationship baggage, which they're still carrying and wondering, you know, will this relationship go well? Will I be able to handle it? Sleepless nights from their side. They've been having sleepless nights because uh, maybe they cut off from you or maybe, you know, you guys went silent with each other or they went silent on you or... Uh, you know they haven't met you much or they've kind of you know the way they've been quiet or and uh, or the way they've been hot and cold you've been wondering if really they want to be with you or not and you finally uh, you know are going to get a message from them or a call from them clearing this out that they want to be with you and it's not that they want to go away okay mind okay mind games is coming so much you know again and again so don't go are these words from them so definitely i told you they don't want you to go guys say what you want to say or you feel feel what is coming quite a lot so there are feelings they're also saying you can say what you want to say to me or what you're feeling probably you've shut yourself out and i think you're also measuring your words or you're also wondering what you should tell them because you also don't know the status of your relationship and that's confused you okay you thought that they, they uh, have feelings or they love you but there is something that has confused you probably the way they've been acting and not giving you much time the usual very standoffish behavior maybe no one is like you i was going to keep that card here but i was like it was almost bouncing back in my hand and i was like no it has to uh, you know be read out and it belongs here so no one is like you definitely i'm in a shell now so probably it's in a they're in a shell but they get, they're gonna crawl out and you wouldn't believe it shell is normally uh, crab no it's cancer that's what we take and uh, i did write cancer i don't know what and that was from the last card and i was like no that sign has to be here because it could be water signs it could be emotional you know it could be something to do with seven number and uh, maybe you were dealing with the water sign you are with the water sign maybe they went in a shell and they are saying that i went in a shell you've got an earth sign also here so one of these signs 
Shell is also like almost saying, you know, Earth sign is also like saying, I went underground or they were hibernating, you know, went underground and, uh, or, you know, went under the water and came up only to see you once in a while, like to uh, breathe the fresh air. I'm getting the, I'm getting tortoise here. I don't know if you were born in the Chinese era for tortoise. Or maybe that's how they were coming slow and that's how they also were that they were in a shell. Maybe a spirit animal is a tortoise or a turtle. Okay. Divine timing. This is the right timing. Things are going to move now. Within seven days, within seven hours, something to do with 777 is what I'm seeing. Don't want to lose you. All, all these cards are saying the same thing. They don't want to lose you. They never left you. They're pretty similar to each other and... Uh, you know, once I show you the other blue cards also where I wrote what they are feeling in words, you will understand. Let's see what are the other messages. So you might have thought that, hey, they've left me or they don't want to be with me, but that's not the case. These cards are pretty huge and a little heavy than regular cards, so seeing which one wow there's triumph there's triumphant success so definitely could be dealing with an air sign we've got a sword here okay definitely with an air sign air sign like i always say is communication it's also the victory probably going to hear from them you know in a day number one is you are number one in their life now and they're going to make sure you remain number one Memories of love, yes. You did uh, leave an imprint on their heart. Like it is, it was difficult to forget you. And uh, probably you made a lot of sacrifices. Maybe in their life they had to make a lot of sacrifices. Maybe it was that they could not give you uh, much time and they had to sacrifice that. Maybe we don't know what situation they were going through. So probably if it was they were going through hell, it was very difficult. But they always kept, um, you know, thinking about you. There were always memories of you. It's not that... Uh, they were not thinking about you or you were not on their mind this is not uh, this is a general reading so i'm not talking about if you guys have been seeing each other not been seeing each other the contact time would be different for all of you but this is uh, what the situation is or feels like that maybe they went away for a little while maybe um they had to sacrifice a lot you had to sacrifice a lot you know and uh, to save the relationship or it could be that you know they left you out in the cold or probably their behavior was not clear you know thinking either they are not there so this is all for you you know if you have been through the situation or you are in the situation these are answers for you and two of them turned and i'm going to use them and they are beautiful beautiful energies and can't be two cards that are so beautiful have come out together so you've got a spiritual union a very twin flame and a very um a very soulmate connection a very past life connection because we also got memories and i think you also feel that there was a past life connection Green seems to be the color for the week because I've been getting green otherwise also for readings and everything. So green is a beautiful color for you guys to use. And uh, and uh, yeah, they have memories of you and you have been together in your past life. That's for sure. And just look at this. This is reunion. This is reunion. This is harmony. I think the word harmony is also very important because maybe the harmony was missing from the relationship. Everything was there. But uh, somewhere because of the... Um, timing or or the problems you know you couldn't balance it out or you guys could not you know uh, show each other how much you love each other or spend that much time okay that's another message that i get the beautiful green color which is also healing of the relationships okay let's see any 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 uh, cards from the witch oracle everyday witch Yeah, a new start. This is how you're going to uh, be feeling and this is how uh, they are going to make you feel or they are feeling and it's almost like happy that things or problems that were there on their plate, I mean they're almost over now and uh, the challenges or the roadblocks they had or you guys had in, you know, between your relationship is going to get over and this is them coming towards you, you know, look at this, fancy free, much, much free, have more time more time to express spend more time a better a better uh, a better relationship between you two yes they are like they've made up their mind it's like they are coming uh, towards you 
they had probably they had to spend time on something else working or their hobbies or they had to go away because of their hobby they have to move away because of a job maybe but now the distances are going to be lessened and i'll show you i think a road distance also that something did uh, you know set you apart could be a job it could be something that you had to stay away see i never left you or i've already told that a reply to your message will be coming so if you send them a message and probably it's been a few days there's no reply or, an, or no reply to a call don't worry they will message or call you i'll be right back is like almost you know i've never left as i'll be right back and i when i wrote right it almost looked like night so it could be that they would reach out reach out to you at night a message or a call these are important numbers for you you could be seeing these numbers i'll also get 777 though i have not written it here so 666-999-888 and 444 are the numbers that you could be seeing. Can you sense my emotions for you? Look, I wrote that word and I was wondering when it's like emotional about you. Definitely emotional about you. Memories, um, past life connection, a bond that's difficult to break. Even if they go, they come back. And it's the same with you. And it's silence broken. Distance could not keep us apart. See, I told you something. Uh, made them go away in the sense they had to you know probably they had to take up a job at another place because they needed the money or they were taking care of someone uh, somebody's health and they had to had to uh, you know leave but definitely silence broken and uh, distances couldn't keep us, ap uh, us apart and that's what they're saying that you know i know that i had to go away but i've come back this is from the uh, some some reading that i did probably years or months ago so you i had the cancer sign it's all it's all about emotions you know I got the word feels, I don't know what it means to you. I got a word black cat, I, wore, I got black color twice. In fact, I was writing with black color and I saw another black pen next to me. So black could be important as a color for you guys. I also wrote hope, okay, don't give up. And definitely that's why it says I never left you, you know, that's a more important message. And I have a butterfly clip here, which is very sweet, which is this color, maybe butterflies, this transformation also, maybe you'll see this color butterfly, you never know. And that's a cute transformation that's a beautiful pink i'm going to do nine cards today let's see what zodiac signs are coming up you've got aries here you've got libra cancer cancer anyway we got you've got virgo aquarius taurus Gemini, you've got Pisces, I think one more, one more, one more, let's see one more, let's take this one, you've got Capricorn, so don't worry if your zodiac sign is not there, if their zodiac sign is not there, and if the messages resonated fine, if this um, these messages are not your situation, it's okay, you can, you know, uh, listen to another reading or uh, come back and listen to me tomorrow. And uh, these are the words I want to say to you and uh, really, really, I don't think they ever left. I think it's the circumstances that make them leave or you go away or some kind of, a, you know, um, whatever happened, you just drifted apart. And I think you have to drift back towards each other. So those were the messages. Thank you for listening to me. Have a beautiful, beautiful Friday and I'll be back with another reading. Do like and do subscribe and do comment. I love all your comments. Bye, guys.